Alright guys, just a quick update on my Warus. If you remember, I got the two little guys. Look at the difference in size. They were the same size when I got them. And the one... It's like almost double the size, that's crazy. Maybe it's a male, a bigger one, the little one's a female, who knows. But I'm doing a water change on the tank. Look at that beauty. Doing a water change, you can see it's probably a third of the way down. Look what I do with my aqua clear. The big, I guess it's the 500 or whatever they call it. 500 gallon an hour. I don't like that you have to fill the tank to the top or otherwise it'll always be making noise. You could hear it. I don't like the noise they make. You usually have to fill it to get rid of that. Like literally, I don't know, maybe see the black uh, molding in the back? Not focusing on it. Probably I'm saying maybe a half inch up into the black molding and I don't like that because then your fish hit these straps that are on the top when they jump out and they get cut up. And I hate the sound of that thing when you have two or three tanks in your room, it's like noisy. So I get this pond filter pad stuff and cut it to the length of the spout as you can see it. And on the back side, I notch out a groove so that it fits over the filter. And then I butt it up to the glass on the top, the canopy, and it holds in place. And all the water trickles down it, like you see, through it. But when you leave it into the tank like a half inch, you don't hear no noise at all. So that's nice. I, I was thinking about doing it on my other tanks, but I just put the canister back on. Check out these two little guys. <laughs> I don't know why they don't grow. They're like midgets. And then the other one's like this big. Litter meat to it. Go figure. Yeah, with the water you can see looks a little cloudy. Not cloudy, but not as clear as it usually looks. It's because it's seven day water change and today's the big day. Let's see them from the top. Big old warriors. Yeah, them guys are getting big. The one's like ten inches. The other one's probably like eight and a half. I don't know if they're male and female. i never seen them try to breed or anything, but that's why I got these two little guys. Hopefully now I have a pair in there. Check them how much different they look when they're little. Red eye coming in, but the blotch on the side, the black blotch still ain't there. And the little one looks even different. It actually has a little black spot on it. They're not like the big ones. Look at how much they change. I get a glare. I can do it better when they're bigger. Well, I'm gonna do my water change. Got everything running in this tank. My pothos plant with this denitrate material it's growing in. Uh, now it's probably like 25 feet of plant. It's crazy. <laughs> and then I have the micron filter which works wonders, takes out everything out of the water, it's like ultra fine. Especially after a water change, like the next three or four days, it really gets clear. And I'm also running since that time, they got the epistylus, a UV sterilizer in the tank too that comes on. Well, actually it comes on for six hours a day with the, uh, light that's on the pothos plant it's on a timer and it's working good i could leave it on longer but i don't think i have to yeah all these big guys gotta be like five six years old the water is in this big seven other than that time they got that epistylus they never really got sick or had anything 
and that was only because it was like my mistake putting a new fish in the tank not doing that anymore anyway guys that's the update I got like another four hours of tank cleaning ahead of me so I'm out of here